Russian President Vladimir Putin says a referendum on independence in eastern Ukraine should be postponed. That comes after Putin held talks with the head of the Organization for Security and Cooperation in Europe. Putin also says his troops have withdrawn from the border with Ukraine. Anya Ardaeva reports from Moscow. Russian President Vladimir Putin said postponing a referendum in eastern Ukraine would create conditions for dialogue in the country. He made his comments following talks with Didier Burkhalter, the Swiss president and current chairman of the Organization for Security and Cooperation in Europe. We think that a direct dialogue between Kiev authorities and representatives of southeastern Ukraine is the key element of resolving the crisis. We call on representatives of southeast Ukraine the supporters of the federalization of the country to postpone the referendum planned for May 11th this year. Pro-Russian separatists in eastern Ukraine have been taking over government buildings and demanding greater autonomy from Kiev in recent weeks. Moscow said violence must be stopped and that the use of military force and armed illegal units, extremist elements and forces was unacceptable, adding that Moscow had withdrawn its troops from the border with Ukraine. We have always been told that our forces on the Ukrainian border are a concern. We have withdrawn them and they are now in places of regular exercise at training grounds. Moscow previously said that holding elections in Ukraine in current conditions was absurd. In what appears to be a softer stance, Vladimir Putin called presidential elections in Ukraine a move in the right direction. But they won't solve anything if all the citizens of Ukraine don't understand how their rights will be guaranteed after these elections are held. The eastern militia groups pressing for a referendum on independence said they will consider holding off on Sunday's referendum. Analysts in Moscow say that the Kremlin reaction to the upcoming elections in Ukraine will play a crucial role. The results of the self-styled um, referendum also would be rather questionable. It would be open for debate and it depends on how Moscow is going to react and will Moscow recognize uh, the presidential result. As, uh, the second round most likely will be decisive anyway. Tensions between Russia and the West over Ukraine remain at their highest point in decades since Crimea seceded from Ukraine and joined the Russian Federation. Anya Daeva, CCTV, Moscow.